Hey Basement Collective fans and AEG fans. If you don't know who AEG is, we're going to explain it real quickly. And of course, if you're a Vanguard, thank you for watching this. My name is Kevin Armitage, as you know, and I am Vanguard number 203. Now I want to talk to you about Alderac Entertainment Group. I hope I said that name right. They are the owners who previously owned the card game Legend of the Five Rings before they sold it. I think that was the second oldest dating back card game just released at the Magic if I'm right. I'm sorry if I'm not. What they are is they are a company that releases tons of stuff. A huge company in the board game industry. And they recently had a program called a Vanguard program. Now if you don't know what a Vanguard program they are basically people <clears throat> sorry, who all director AEG works with to get demos of games out and get their games out to the community. You get well, I, got, I got this for free, but they give you cheap discounts. And if you have a reach in your community, or you want to start up a community, a gaming club, or you work for a store, or anything, and you think you'd make a great demo for these games, there will be a link in the description below. You fill out a couple pieces of information. And you go, and you could be a Vanguard, and the Vanguards have tons of privileges, we get free stuff, we get discounts on a lot of stuff, and uh, most of all, we get to share games with people, so I am a Vanguard for AEG. And the most recent game they released is this game. I think it's available at retail right now, it might not be, but it will be very soon if it isn't. And this is a game called Octo Dice. Now I don't exactly know how to play it, because I just got this today, but let's go ahead and take a look at it. It's the newest release game, they have tons of games. They make the stuff, uh, they make Doomtown, they make Smash Up, they make lots of games. Certainly go check them out. But let's go ahead and see what's in Octodice for us today. So, we, of course, we got our handbook. And then we got some tokens. Now they have tons of premier stuff, and now we got a bunch of scorecards. Cool. And then in there we have dice and then uh, this is your batch number right there if you have any issues uh, you certainly need it so let's go ahead and just slip that underneath there in case we ever have any issues with it we can send the batch number in now if you're a Vanguard I hope you've got your copy of this if you haven't certainly go check out the Vanguard Armory which is the Armory Vanguards get access to on the AEG web store that has tons of discounted stuff so guys please if you think this is something you'd be interested in demoing games for this company you get free games they expect you to demo, but certainly if you like that, go check out the link below. Otherwise, let's go ahead and check it out. So this is, looks like a simple game, at least. So of course you got your dice, the cubes in there. Uh, custom dice. High quality custom dice, you can see. Right, and then you got your score pad. Your tokens. Punch those out. Let's go ahead and see a uh, description of the Octo Dice game. We're not going to go through the game completely, we'll just take a look at it. And we'll look, take a look at the book. So let's zoom in, guys. Perfect. So here we are. It's a game for one to four players, ages 14 and up. So it might be a bit more of a complicated game. And it says, as scientists and engineers on the board of the underwater research station Octosphere, you're facing a big crisis. Your most important tools, the bots, have stopped working. It is time to take matters into your own hands, but quickly. After all, you want to have a major scientific breakthrough before the competition does. In short time, you, ha you must expand your labs, analyze crystals, dock new submarines, reactivate the bots, and catch octopods. Be careful though, you never know whether the competition is spying you. Objectives, you win the game when by using this dice skillfully to collect the most knowledge points. Knowledge points, just called points, in the remainder of this book are indicated in the light bulb symbol and of course you have your components right here so uh, your three dice of symbols three black dice 16 markers four of each your scorecards and that okay now it's going to take you through setup here we're not going to read it all like I said we're just going to give a quick view And of course, there's some bonus scoring, intermediate scoring, different ways to play. Uh, an example of turn solo games, two players, uh, tiles. Perfect. And there's your credits and copyright, guys. Um, I am making this video, first of all, to show the Octodice game. We're going to have a video of the gameplay up soon enough. And if you're in Sudbury, we'll have a demo of it 
a live demo soon enough. But mostly this video is to tell you about Octodice and also to tell you about the AEG Vanguard program. Lots of companies have the programs, but AEG does it very well, better than any company I've ever seen. You're an AEG representative, a Vanguard as they're called. They get you free stuff, you expect it to do stuff for that free stuff, not like um, you have to, but you know, if you're given these games, you expect it to demo the games. We're going to demo it on our channel as well as in person. You don't always have to have a YouTube channel like me. You can have a reach out a local store, you can have a gaming group and say, hey guys, I can get us a bunch of demo games, we can play them out. They have stuff like Doomtown and Smash Up, and those are great card games, and those games have tournament kits, and with, with those tournament kits, you know, you can run tournaments, um, all great price, please go check out the link below, they give you a bunch of information. Thank you Basement Collective fans for watching this, and thank you all the Vanguards and the Vanguard group watching this, this is Kevin Vanguard 203 and of course Kevin from the Basement Collective signing off and keep on board gaming and war gaming guys.